Hey guys, and welcome to my kitchen. I want to share with you a little recipe of my sofrito. Sofrito is what we call in South America or Latin America. There is our base for most soups or casseroles, and you can see I'm like saute them before I do my soup. I'm gonna prepare black bean soup, but this could be for like vegetable soup, uh, chicken soups, um, casseroles, or anything that you like. What I do is I chop very fine, uh, small to medium uh, like onion, and that will depend on like how much you're gonna cook. Um, one or two garlic cloves, then I shred some um, carrots for flavor and color. Um, I also has a small tomato. I use the tomato because I feel like those are more flavored, but you know, um, a small vine red tomato that is ripe will do. Um, chop it very fine so you can see it's almost like a paste. Um, I also have, I add an orange, red, or yellow, a uh, small sweet green pepper. Um, I wouldn't do the green um, because it's too um, rich in flavor, so you don't want it to overpower the rest of the condiment. A little bit of sea salt or Himalayan salt uh, will do. You can add pepper also, uh, but it's just, this is pretty much for the base of your soup. And you know, you can add broth, vegetable broth, chicken broth, bone broth, whatever it is that you like for the rest of your soup. But this will help with the flavor. It's also full of antioxidants. Um, in order to do this, I'm using clarified ghee butter. Uh, clarified butter, that is ghee. Uh, you can also use um, organic butter. Remember for sauteing or cooking, when you heat up the oil, we don't use oil. We use butter or uh, coconut oil because the olive oil or any other oil, w when you heat it, it will release free radicals and you know that's not good for your health. All right, so enjoy it. And I hope this, you know, will help to add some flavor to your soups and your uh, recipes. Take care.